Okay, so there was a good comment in one of the videos that stated or asked why not use your county's GIS and mapping system to find your parcel and get the measurements from there and use the tools there. Well, let me show you. So, from Acosta County in Michigan, here's their GIS system. Let's go put in my information. When I click on it, this parcel has not been mapped. So that is one reason why I can't use the county G GIS system for this. Now let's go put in um, some information real quick. Let's do a search for another piece of property. So we did a search for another piece of property, another piece of property I'm very familiar with. Well, let me zoom in. Cannot zoom in. So that to me is an issue. And of course, every GIS system is different. This just happens to be the one that I'm currently stuck with. Zoom in feature is not working. I can get the details, but I can tell you, you see where this red border is? This is not the property. Okay? This house does not own this person's garage. So, whatever information they've used did not get translated into their mapping system properly. Okay? Look at these houses. These houses do not own hundreds of feet of the lake. Okay? So, the mapping system for your GIS in the county is not always accurate and there are disclaimers as such stating that you must use a survey in addition to this which is why I choose to do it myself using Google Earth instead of the mapping tools they provide of course it's great for giving you information you know tax information and all that good stuff that's what you know you would use a GIS system mostly for and I'll go into that in detail later and while there are measuring tools and all different types of uh, line tools and things like that within the GIS system, it's only good if your boundaries are correct and you're able to zoom into a much greater detail. You can see that there is a big difference between using Google Earth and a GIS system. Another reason it's hard to use a GIS mapping system online is because the information may be incorrect. So right here it's saying this is my property. However, I do not own this entire piece of property. I only own half and half. I only own this portion right here, but it's showing I own 40 acres. All right. So now you know why I use Google Earth in a survey instead of using a county GIS system. That was a good question. Thank you. Keep them coming. Please get on the HowlingFarms.com website. Post your questions there and your comments there. I would love to hear your feedback. Um, this question just happened to be one that stood out in the YouTube comments. And I figured I would address it uh, in a video. All right. Have a good one.